Hi there, my name is Cooper Levy Baker. I'm the editor in chief of Sarasota Magazine, and I recently learned how to speak French. It took about an hour. Je m'appelle Cooper Levy Baker. Je suis le rédacteur en chef de Sarasota Magazine. In that same hour, I also happened to master Arabic and Portuguese. Ismi Cooper Levy Baker. Ana raiz de tahrir fi majallat Sarasota. Meu nome é Cooper Levy Baker. Sou editor chef da Sarasota Magazine. Not bad, huh? All it took was some AI wizardry, courtesy of Jersey Gustek of Money Shot SRQ and Damon Shakiri of Evolve Media, who share a multimedia production space in a quiet office above Michael's on East. Here's how it works. You stand in front of a green screen with a video camera trained on you and you talk about anything you like for at least two minutes. It doesn't really matter what you say, it's how you say it that counts. The goal is to create an accurate record of how your voice sounds and how your face and body move when you talk. I had to record my video twice because apparently I wave my hands like a maniac when the camera starts rolling and that can cause problems when the footage is fed into the AI video tool HeyGen, the next step in the process. After uploading my clip, Gustek feeds random text into an AI system and asks it to translate different sections into a variety of languages. We wait a few minutes and then, voila, my digital avatar is ready and he, meaning me, begins to speak. Watching myself talk and hearing words I never said coming out of my mouth is more than a little unnerving. My brain can't help but dwell on worst case scenarios. What if someone used this technology to make me say something I abhor? But I can also understand the appeal. Gustek is using HeyGen with a number of clients who need short videos of them speaking to share with customers and on social media. The idea is attractive to busy executives who can come to the studio just once and then create new videos in the future simply by sharing text. Think of a realtor who might freeze up on camera and doesn't know what to say. Now that person can create endless video clips of themselves without the stress and anxiety that comes with filming. I'm essentially a Luddite, and I remain skeptical about how the flurry of new AI technology we're seeing now is going to affect art and creativity. But I'm also curious about what it can do, which is why I asked Gustek to help me make this video. Will my digital avatar one day supplant the real me? Could he one day sit in on meetings I don't want to attend while I'm goofing off somewhere far away? Hmm, maybe I'm starting to see the upside of this AI thing. Thank you for your time and I hope you enjoyed our presentation. I trust that you or members of your team will be inspired by the options MoneyShot is presenting. Please do not hesitate to call me and ask any questions. And no, I'm not an avatar. Or am I? <laughs>